Hello, a warm welcome from New CNC, a small family company with a simple but noble vision to make a difference. As you all are aware, we are faced with uncertainty and live in a very unprecedented times. The future is less vivid and unknown. Almost everything has slowed down and shut down, issues with supply chain and many others. But we are trying to push it forward, now even harder than ever, so that you will receive your encore soon. It has been two years now since our Kickstarter campaign for the Encore V1. Oh no, long time. Meanwhile, Intel has developed and released many new versions of the CPU generations. No wonder. Each differ greatly in the thickness. Our response to those changes resulted in redesign and improvements to the initial version of the Encore. Cooling area has been increased by 201%. Locking mechanism has been modified so that it will fit many CPU families. RGB feature has been added. However, the biggest difficulty we've experienced and had to resolve was to make the Encore fit the whole range of the 1151 LGA CPUs. You know that CPUs have different PCB thicknesses and different die thicknesses. This fact sparked a new idea and let us to come up with a new solution, a new device that will become a part of the Encore product family, the Enlap. Our freshly designed and manufactured revolutionary lapping device offers three core features. Lapping allows you to precisely lap your IHS and CPU dies with resolution of 0.01 mm. Measuring enables monitoring of your CPU die and IHS thickness with resolution of 0.01 mm. Simultaneously at four points. I want to point out here that these measurements are very important for us to finish the Encore project. It is a keyring, a way of supporting what we at New CNC are trying to achieve. So we've got NLAP IHS to modify IHS and NLAP die, which has initially been created to become part of the Encore project, although it can be used to lap a deleted CPU if you are using the NLAP IHS as well. The bundle of IHS and die will allow not only to even the contact surface between IHS and your cooler, but also to decrease its height. So the surface will be touching the die in 9900K model. We know that there is a gap there after you remove the solder. More details in the Bauer video which describes this topic extensively. The NLAP IHS allows for this gap to be modified to the point that IHS touches the die on the entire contact surface. The NLAP die can also decrease the die thickness, if you dare of course. Having in mind that 9900K model is nearly two times thicker than 8700K, you can remove a lot of material lapping the die as it is made from silicon. Its thermal conductivity is smaller than copper. Decreasing the die thickness as well as the IHS thickness increases the performance of your CPU. So just take it to the next level, guys. The NLAP die and IHS have become available to order in our shop just now. We would like to express our utmost appreciation to all of you who already ordered Encore product as a thank for your patience and understanding of the difficulties, NLAP die will be added free of charge to all your Encore orders. 